Hi and welcome to the Atom Shop channel on YouTube and this is another part of the UI table view demonstration and in this screencast I'm going to show you how you can actually delete rows from a UI table view control. So if I run my app right now it's going to display a simple grid control and I can scroll I can see all the elements and uh, we will add a edit button over here all right so let's go ahead and do that this is the interface designer I'm just going to drag a button over here place it and it's gonna say edit all right now we need to handle the click event of this button which will be an IB action here we go um, edit button clicked if you're interested you will get the sender all right and uh, you will go over here and we can simply go ahead and hook it up to our button so let's go ahead and implement this method in our implementation file IB action and this is a edit button clicked and here we go so we got it implemented so self um, this is a table view set editing I'm just gonna say yes animated yes okay so let's run this let's see what happens so if I say edit, you can actually see now there's a negative sign over here. If I minus sign to delete the rows, if I say delete, it shows me the delete button. And if I click the delete button, basically nothing happens because we haven't implemented this. One of the things you need to do before you do that is to uh, use the, te uh, the consume the delegate, which is UI table view delegate. Okay. Um, and that's pretty much it so now we need to implement the delete function okay so if I go over here in the documentation for UI table view data source so this will show you a method It's called a commit editing style okay and basically the documentation says that this method is fired when you have a green button green plus which is like a plus button when you add or delete the items from a UI table view so let's go ahead and implement this method this will allow us to delete the rows from a UI table view so I usually just copy and paste it just like that and now we are implementing this method um, at this point we are going to make a check that if editing style is equal to a UI table view cell editing style delete so if the editing style is delete then we can go ahead and remove the cell so it's it will it will it's a good idea to remove the cell first from the data source so we have our data source which is self dot customers right and I'm just going to say remove object at index and this will be uh, index path dot row so this will remove the object from uh, the uh, collection that we have that the UI table view is bound to uh, now we need to also remove it from the table view so self dot table view and delete rows at index path and we're going to say NS array and uh, this is a array with object which will be uh, index path with row animation so this will be UI table view row animation fade and in the end since we want when we delete we want to refresh the grid view or the UI table view we're just going to say self table view uh, reload data okay and I'm going to run it let's see what happens if I say edit I'm just going to delete number two number two is gone if I say delete number four number 4 is gone if I delete number 10 number 10 is gone so you can actually see that the deletion is working correctly okay 
And that's pretty much it. It's pretty simple to implement the delete operation in a UI table view uh, because most of the delegates are already given to you and you just have to write a little bit of code as you saw in this example uh, to, to work it out. That's pretty much it. I hope you like this tutorial. Thank you very much.